Hello friends, today we are going to solve CBSC class 10th exercise 13.1 question number 4. A cubical block of size 7 cm is surmounted by a hemisphere. What is the greatest diameter the hemisphere can have? Find the surface area of the solid. Means we are having a cubical block of size 7 cm. We are drawing a figure. This is a box, cubical box of side 7 cm. Is surmounted by a hemisphere. So here we are getting a hemisphere. Look here, I am drawing. This is the base of the hemisphere and this is the hemisphere. What is the greatest diameter the hemisphere can have? We know the side is 7 so from here to here the greatest diameter possible greatest diameter will be also 7 centimeter the greatest diameter the hemisphere can have is 7 find the surface area of the solid so obtain so surface area of solid equals to now we know first we are having this all four side then the part at the downstairs and the upper part. In upper part we have to find this all corners only because this circle part is enclosed by this hemisphere. So what we are going to do? First we are going to find out the total surface area of cube. Then we are going to subtract this circle and we are going to add this hemisphere or directly I can write adding CSA of hemisphere minus this enclosed part that will be circle so that is area of circle so surface area of solid is equal to TSA of cube that is 6 L square plus CSA of hemisphere that is 2 pi R square minus area of circle that is pi R square now we know these two are like terms 2 pi r square minus pi r square. So don't directly put out the values. First we have to solve this also. That will be 6 l square plus pi r square. Now you can put the values. 6 and the length square. That is length is 7. So 7 square. Plus 22 by 7 as radius. Sorry as pi is not given to you. We are going to take 22 by 7 and radius. We know diameter is 7, so radius will be 7 by 2, 2 times 7 by 2 into 7 by 2. This 7, 7 get cancelled to 1, this will be 11. So here, here you will get 77 by 2. And here, 6 into 7 square, that is 6, 7 square 49. Now we are going to multiply 6 into 9, 54, 5 carry 24 plus 5, 29. Then addition of this 77 by 2 that is 3 and 16 so 8.5. Now adding this 0.5, 8 and 4, 12, carry 1, 9, plus 1, 10, 13, carry 1, 3, 3, 2.5 centimeter square. So this way we can find out the surface area of this solid. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.